Hello, are you having problem with your Raspberry Pi? When you're trying to install operating system in Raspberry Pi, your Raspberry Pi keeps booting and booting and rebooting and rebooting and you're unable to install it, then get tuned. We will fix this problem in this video. There's a very simple trick to solve this problem, so get tuned. Hello friends, so this is my Raspberry Pi and it's booting and it's connected to a normal Android charger. I don't know which company charger is this, but when I bought people told that it's a good charger. And you can see my desktop here, it's currently blank now, but it should work. Yeah, see, it has again restarted. It will start and again it will restart. And when I was installing my system, I found that uh, I could open this and when I'm installing the Raspbian, when it is 15%, 20% or 25 it will again restart, it will start from the same place and it was very annoying. It was really, really annoying like you can see now. See, it's again restarting. So how do we fix this problem? So there's a simple fix to this problem. See, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to change the charger or the cable. The problem is there is a drop in voltage many times because of the charger or the cable. So it keeps restarting and restarting. So now here I'm going to use my Samsung charger here. Now this is my original Samsung charger from my phone and I'm going to use this original cable which I came from the Samsung. So I'm going to connect it now. And now I'm going to unplug this one plug this original Samsung charger and I'm going to change it here or right from here okay so I'll unplug this charger and I'll connect this one I'll plug this Samsung's original charger yes it's been tuned now and now you see my desktop Yeah, so it's the same. It's going to start. It's starting. We can see there some logo. And here you see I'm using this charger now. And everything is going well. So let's see. And I'm, I'm sure that this time the system will start very well. Let's just wait. Yes, can you see this desktop? Yes, it's very nice. Now I can use even all the programs, etc. So this is the simple hack. You either have to change the charger. This is a cheap charger, which I was using for my Raspberry Pi. And this is from my Samsung's original charger. So it works and this one is original data cable. Or you can also try to use another data cable which is thicker, better or what we say the original one and it should work perfectly fine. You can see here I can use everything now. So this is it guys. This is for the tutorial. Just change your charger and you will be all right. Or you can just change the data cable. The cable might be the faulty one or the charger. So that is the major problem. Okay, that's it for this video.